this is like the seawater version of stickleback fishing I've got my mini rod and reel exactly as I do for sticklebacks and I'm, I'm on a rock pool as you can see there and it is shallow but in some parts it's probably maybe eight inches deep or whatever and I did spend some time here this afternoon on the way back from fishing the rocks my wife had said to me I've seen some little fish in there darting around and she was correct of course and as I sat there for a while I threw little pieces of lugworm in and it looks like there's nothing there and just like the sticklebacks something appears and we're talking tiny fish now very very small fish and they appear and they'll start messing about with the log and then you see little crabs come out from under rocks take the log and go back so I thought well I was intending to do some of this type of fishing anyway so I thought I will return with the rod so let's cast out and see how it goes I've got a I've got a shrimp down there actually he's just taken the taken the bait let's have a look oh missed it he wonders he wonders what's going on it's never happened to it ever before I'm going to drop down again this is interesting it, again it's come straight onto the bait I'm giving it time to just hold on to it I'm fishing with a, a size 14 hook tiny little piece of worm and the shrimp is now on top of the worm it's crystal clear I can see what's going on oh not quite again I'll tell you what I have bought disgorgers anyway I haven't got a, a shot or anything on there so I am just dropping the bait in and the shrimp wonders where it's gone right let's have another go look how simple that is just a very very simple approach and I'm gonna have me uh, another go and as soon as it goes into the water there it is I need to let the creature get hold of the bait and then I'll be able to lift it from the water I'll tell you what let's go for this one shall we oh almost it's like the sticklebacks that drop off this is exciting isn't it fishing a rock pool but not with a, a little net and a bamboo cane <laughs> actually with a, a rod and reel and I was thinking to myself I should have bought my mini scales because you never know what I'll catch, do you? I've decided to move to uh, another pool, only yards away from the one that I was just fishing. All those, well, I think shrimps, I think they're probably prawns, actually. They were all going for it, but none of them would hang on. So very difficult to get one, of course. Dil Dilwyn's down by the side of me, eating seaweed. Seems to like that. So I've decided to go for this deeper pool here and it's got well, two particularly deep sections so I'm dropping a bait in and see how it goes. I'm not a blanker, well it's not a fish but it's one of those little prawns that I was talking about that jump around as well. There you go and that one's going to jump back into the water right now. <laughs> 